Hi everyone, Chloe Libby here, and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to Costco for the new box sets, you guys. I'm super excited. I'm looking for the one with Patty, of course. I've always wanted Patty, and now I have a chance to find her. I'm super, super stoked. Let's just get into it. Time to look for the box sets. Well, this is a brand new squad. Only two left, and they're basically all Dumbo octopus left. But honestly, she's my favorite. She's so cute. But I'm not gonna get a 24 inch unless it's like roaming the earth because I already have Ronnie. Oh my gosh, you guys, the box sets. Look at. This was at three. There is three, but I didn't notice until I came back a couple days later. Don't mind if I do, <laughs> if I can get it out. <laughs> I thought there was supposed to be three. There's a really cute one with Patty and Joelle. Oh my gosh, and Avery and the new little kitty with the curved ears, Pilar. I'm so excited. Little Meadow. So I'm gonna get this one. You guys are only $22. So that's such a good price. Kind of want to get both, but they have a lot here, so I can wait on that. And then they have the food squad. I really love the sushi and the dragon fruit mostly. Here are all the ones that they have. Here are all the ones that are in here. I am so excited, you guys. Patty is one of my biggest dreams, and I love Pilar. And I really want one of these kitties, and I'm so excited about really all of them. I already have a five inch Joelle, but it's okay. Cute fries, s'mores. I really love the avocado toast. He's so cute. I mean, they're really all so adorable, but I'm just going to get one set, at least for this video. Don't want to have to open up two sets in the video since there's eight in each box. That's such a good price. Eight, five inches for only 22. And I can't believe they're out already and I didn't miss them because last year I missed all of the box sets. They also still have tons of these guys left. I'm so excited, you guys. Can't believe I found them. Let me know down below if you guys would get this one or if you guys would get this one. I'm getting this one for the cow, obviously. I really want Patty. I mostly want her in the hugging form, but this is good enough. I'm super excited, you guys. Oh my gosh. And here is a close-up of the food squish. They are so cute. I really love the dragon fruit and the sushi. I love the ramen. I love the cheeseburger. I love all of them, but I really have to limit myself when getting squish. Oh, and look who else is here as well. He was hidden. You guys, I had a problem because I also wanted this box set. Oh, there's also this Sea Life one. So they have three different box sets, which is pretty cool. Gordon is adorable. I wonder if it's black tipped Gordon. Let's see. Yes, it is. It's black tipped Gordon. Sheldon. Cole. Violet. A little crab. Ricky, Kai, and Bruce. They are so cute. I really like the sea turtle and Gordon, and the seahorse. Let me know down below what set would you guys get. I'm doing this one. Or would you guys get the sea life one, the foodie set, or the little animal one? Let me know down below. Three different sets. Oh my gosh. I never find the Costco box sets. I'm so excited. And you guys, I also found bath bombs. And these are also like really close price to the five inches. So I don't know why you would get these opposed to the actual squish. They're so cute. Look at the cow. Didn't notice this before, but it comes with eight charms. Surprise mystery squish mallow charms. So it might be worth the price, but. Still, I'm wide by this when you can buy the plush, right? And I'll show you guys what the charms look like. I've only found one example of them so far. But they're super cute. Just not my style. Oh my god, look at the sheer amount of squish that they have. It's insane. I really want Pilar. But I don't need a big boy. Axolotl. Gardenia. They have the doggy, that guy. And they have this set. He's so cute. And then, by the way, guys, this is a little bit after, like a week later, and they're like all gone. There's still the food set, which I really only want for like these two. They're super cute. And then the sea set, which I want as well, but 
I don't want at least half of them and I'm not gonna get it because of that. Okay, so this is actually another day at Costco, but it's just like the next day. And they have so many more. They have a tiger, they have the beaver again, and they have the giant bearded dragon. So cute. I am really tempted to get one of these guys, but I already have the massive Ronnie, and like one of these is enough for me. She already takes up half my bed. There's a dog, and Tito, and the frog. There's a burrito for the 12 inches, the boba, that one's so cute. So many, oh there's Kamalita, uh, Burger Boy, I can't see who else, Rodri, so cute. Okay guys, so I'm doing this one, I'm super excited, and I'll probably be back in the next week to get the other one. Oh my gosh you guys, I did not think I would find it, let alone the first day I checked. I am so happy, I cannot wait to get home and open it for you guys. Look how cute, this is going to be my first ever patty, I'm so excited. Okay you guys, so I am super excited, look how cute they are! I cannot wait until I get home to open them, so this one comes with a cute meadow, and then it comes with Joelle and Avery. Tabitha is the new little kitten. It comes with Brian, the cute schnauzer I'm super excited for, Pilar the grasshopper, Patty the cow, and Greta the bear. I am so excited. Oh my gosh, they have even more box sets. Wow. Three more. They really six. I can't do all six in one hand this year. I honestly had no idea they were going to release six different Squish box sets, and then they released ornament box sets. It's crazy. They released so much Squish this year. This one is like a random set that has like food squish and like animal squish. It's really cute. That one's adorable. The pizza. This one is super cute. I love that guy. These are the cuties that they have. And then there's also this one, which I think I will get. If it has the cute Bigfoot. As well as the dragon. And again, I have the same dilemma where I want two or three, but not enough to get the whole box set. But like, I don't know, I really only want Zaley. So at this point, is it even worth it? I don't know. Now this one I know is new, because this, these guys are all new. They made like the Valentine sets into tiny five inches. This one is super cute. Like, I would love to have these two as five inches, but I already have these four and eight inches, so why even get it? In my opinion, I think I like the first wave of box sets better. However, like I said, I can't get over how cute the milk and cookies are. And to me, this is the weirdest box set because it has a plant, food, and animals. This one is, of course, my favorite, however, of the new three that they released today. I don't know. This one is so cute. Should I get it? I think I'll wait on it. I don't know. I do not think they're going to have more box sets already. But, I don't know, like I said, I like Zaylee. But, like, most of these box sets, I only like, like two of the eight. And I'm not going to get it if I only like not even half of them, you know? But the box is patty, I liked more than half, so that's why I got it. Okay, you guys, so I'm back home, and I'm so excited. There are so many cute ones in this box. And oh my gosh, patty, she will be my first ever patty. I'm so excited, and my first tiny little Avery. And I do already have 5-inch Joelle, but it's okay. So I literally just got back from Costco today, and they had the three other box sets, which I think they're all really cute. But I think out of the six that they released, I think this is my favorite because it has more than like two or three that I want. I literally want all of them. So I am really excited, and let's crack it open. Also, yes, I've had this for a couple weeks now, but I'm finally doing the video. So it's literally been really hard for me not to open it, but I finally am today. Let me know down below which one is the one you guys want the most. My top three I want the most are these three. I love Pilar the Grasshopper. Anyways, let's get it open. I love the box sets, and this is my second ever box set I've gotten, so I'm really excited to open another one for you guys. 
The sad thing is they don't have bio tags. They just have their bio printed on the box, but we can open it now. Okay, here we go. Oh my gosh, you guys. The moment I've been waiting for. They're so beautiful. Oh my gosh. This set was like 20 something dollars and there's literally eight five inches in it. That is like the cheapest squish set you could literally ever find anywhere. Nothing like a fresh box of Squishmallows. So let's get out our first one, which is a super cute little five inch meadow. And I'm really excited because now I can get rid of my 12 inch meadow. So I can at least have one in my collection. And cause I'm trying to downsize, you know, as best as I can. And Little Meadow, it's so stinking cute. I really love the horses. I am a horse girl. I used to own an Arabian, actually, when I was like 12, 13. So that was pretty cool. So, you know, I do love the horse Squishmallows. So I had to get this box, not only for Patty and these beautiful guys, but also since I could downsize to this cute little tiny meadow. She is so cute and she literally looks exactly like Bubba. I always wondered why they made them look so similar, but that is a little meadow. And then we have Greta the Bear, and this was actually going to be my first Greta the Bear, but I just recently won a Fuzzy Belly one from the claw machines at Circus Circus. You guys can check out that video, it will be linked at the end. Alright you guys, so here's Fuzzy Belly Greta. She is so cute and she actually looks different, like besides the Fuzzy Belly. They have different color tummies, noses, and ears. Also, this one looks more like a corgi than a bear compared to this one because of the nose. So I wonder why they decided to go along with that <laughs> design. But either way, they're both really cute. This one is a bit more simple. Let me know down below which Greta do you guys prefer. I think this one, like I said, looks like a corgi when you compare it to this Greta. So I think it's a bit weird how different they look. Wow, never would have noticed that. All right, so that's a cute little Greta. And moving on to this cute little kitty. Okay, so here is a super cute kitty. Now, I did think this was like the Scottish Fold one that they came out recently where the ears are a bit like wrinkled and stuff. But it seems like this is just a typical regular cat squish, which I'm okay with because she is so stinking cute. I love her coloring and her ears are like galaxy colored, rainbow colored. So cute. And of course, the fuzzy belly. I love the fuzzy bellies. So this one is so adorable. Like I said, this whole box is super cute. There's not one single squish that I don't like. So this is why this is my favorite box. But yeah, so here is a cute little kitty. I believe her name is Tabitha. So she's very unique. And I don't think I've seen this version of Tabitha before. Let me know down below if you guys have seen her in any other size, because I don't think I have. And I'm here for it because she is so cute. And next we have Pilar the grasshopper and he is so cute. I love the bug squishmallows just because I like bugs in general. So when I found out this set had Avery, Patty, and Pilar, I was going crazy because I've always wanted a 5 inch Pilar and now I have him. I also have a 14 inch I believe from Walmart. I'm just so happy to have him in a tiny little version. Isn't he so cute? Now I would have loved if it was rutabaga actually because i do want a five inch of her a bit more but like i said i was still really happy pilar was included he's so cute look at his little bug flaps he's saying hi hello oh my gosh so cute and i love the green squishmallows just green in general so i can add this to my green collection ah oh, i love his little blush so that is pilar and of course no tail because he is a little bug Oh my gosh, so excited that I got him. Isn't he adorable? Okay, guys, we're halfway through and our next one is Joelle the Bigfoot. Oh my gosh, isn't she adorable? Now, I already have a 5-inch Joelle and here's mine. Here is the difference. And honestly, I kind of like mine better. Um, definitely the hair is a lot nicer and smoother compared to this one. Do you guys see that? It's like, I don't know. And like this part, I've had problems with my Bigfoot squish before, like their hair right here. But it seems they're all kind of crappy. I mean, look at that piece right there. Oops. Should I pull it out? I don't know. But, um, oh no. Okay. Okay, I'll stop. Okay. Yeah, so this one seems a bit more chonkier, actually. She seems very chonky, as you can see. But she is so cute. And since I already have her, I think I'm going to give her to my friend for Christmas. They will definitely love her and they haven't had a single Bigfoot squish in their collection, so I think they'll be really excited. But that is Joelle. She has more of a straight across little 
face than this one. As you can see, hers is a bit more curved. I mean, they look the same, but they look different, right? Their faces? Anyways, let me know down below which one would you guys want. I'm just nitpicking here, but they are both so cute. So I will keep this one, though, because obviously she has her tag, which is a bummer, like I said. The box set squish, or the capsule squish, or the blind bag squish, they never have tags. And it's really a bummer. I mean, they could totally just put... Look it. You can fit a tag on your box squishmallows. Like, they fit. That is Joelle. So cute. Also, she like barely fits in here, as you can see. Look at her little floof of hair. Okay, you guys, we only have three left. And our next one is Brian the Schnauzer, and I've always wanted him. So I had a Schnauzer before, and I gave it away in my giveaway. It was really sad because I wanted another one, but I'm glad I gave it away because now I have a little five inch because this little guy reminds me of my Nudgy's little Schnauzer that she had. So he is so cute. However, I did notice there's a bunch of like strain stuck on these squish. I guess I should have noticed that in store, but it doesn't matter. Nothing some scissors can't fix. But this is Brian the Schnauzer, and he is so cute. I'm not one to really collect the dogs much, but since this one kind of had sentimental value to me, representing my Nudgy's dog, I definitely had to get him. And I'm going to rename him to Fritz, because that was her dog's name, and he's just so cute. And I really love the gray squish, so I'm actually happy that I now have another gray squish for my collection, because they really don't make many gray squishmallows. So that is cute little Brian. One of the rare dogs you will find in my collection. Now, you guys, down to the last two, the best two, arguably, is little 5-inch Avery. Oh my gosh, I've never seen Avery this tiny before. He is so cute. Yes! Another one for my brown and green collection. Yes, another one. Another one. Oh, I had to say it. <laughs> Literally freaking adorable. I cannot believe it. He's so cute. And look, it's blue, doo, 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 doo. His little feathers. Woo, 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 woo. I have to do that. He's just so cute. I love, I love him. Beautiful colors. He's so vibrant and just so basic. He's such a classic Squishmallow. Everyone loves Avery. And we can see why. He's just so beautiful. And even the five inches are really nicely embroidered, as you can see. So that is nice to see. I am really excited to have Avery. Now I have like fuzzy Avery, I have five inch Avery, and I have a regular Avery. So super cute. I can add to my little Avery collection I have going on. And now you guys, our final squish of the box. The one everyone bought this box for. Five inch Patty. Oh my gosh. Now, oh my gosh. And this one is a little defected. I mean, it's not defective, but you can see that like curve and shadow above her right eye. But besides that, she's so gorgeous, you guys. I've always wanted Patty, especially the Hug Me version. I had been looking for her for like literally a year. I gave up because, you know, she's one of the rarest Squishmallows you can find is her in a Hug Me form. But I just about screamed when I found out that they were releasing her in a Costco box set. And the fact that I was there when they had them was crazy good luck. She is so gorgeous. Also, she definitely is defected because if you set her up straight, her eye is going down to the right. It's not straight across from that one. But you know what? She's fine. She's goofy. And it's on me for not really looking to make sure I didn't get a defected one. But wow, the colors are just gorgeous. Yes, literally. And look at her beautiful little tail, little pink and purple tail. Literally, her details are so cute. I'm just freaking out because I've never held Patty, like an OG Patty, in my hands before. Wow, I really love the color combination, and now I see why she's like crazy popular, because she is so stinking cute. However, of course she has a camel tail. Why can't they ever make Squishmallows without this weird seam in the front? I mean, and why do you have to place it right there? Like, come on, Kelly Toys. What is that? Let me know down below, is Patty the Cow your favorite of this box set? Or do you prefer Avery or Joelle or anyone else? I would love to know because literally i don't think i've ever held her before in my entire life and this is this is a moment for me you guys i am freaking out she's so dang cute so that is patty the cow yes i finally have her that is beautiful patty oh my gosh 
Okay, you guys, so that was the box opening. Yes, and of course, I'm not going to keep them in the box. I will probably just take them out. However, these are kind of cool. If you can, like, cut this part off and then somehow put this on the wall, you can, like, display your squish on the wall like that. So, actually, I might try doing that. I am just so excited. Like I said, I could not believe I found this box set because last year I missed all of the Squishmallow box sets, if you can believe that. So, yes, I was so happy to get it. Yes! Let me know down below which box set did you guys get? Did you get any of the first three or did you get any of the new ones that I showed you guys today? All right, you guys, that was the video. I am so happy to have Patty. She's so cute. Don't forget to leave a like and comment down below which of the six box sets would you guys get if you could only choose one. Obviously, I would have got Obviously, I would get this box set. However, I really like the Sea Life one. That was really cute. And the food ones, I mean, so many. I just really, you know, I didn't need like three box sets. So I just got myself one. But there is the Christmas ornament box sets that I should be seeing pretty soon. So make sure to check out for that video as well. And subscribe so you guys can see, of course, when it comes out. And I love you guys so much. See you guys in the next one. Bye. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you.